Good morning and welcome to the June video blog for Bucyrus City Schools. I am your superintendent, Dr. Todd M. Nichols, and here to talk to you today about school being out, but school's really not out for us. While the regular school year has, has ended and commencements went fantastically, we appreciate the participation of 1961 graduate Ken Coyle in our commencement ceremonies, we move into the summer sessions. We have our summer programs that are taking place at Bucyrus Elementary and Bucyrus Secondary School. Uh, please contact those buildings for the opportunity to participate in our intervention programs and our enrichment programs at both buildings. Um, we are extending opportunities for K-5 students at the elementary student or at the elementary school and we also have credit recovery, credit enrichment programs at Bucyrus Secondary School. Please contact those buildings for more information with, with regard to each of those programs. I'm really, really proud of our staff and our, our principals at each one of the buildings. We're, we're starting to see some of our preliminary results uh, that are associated with our progress through the year and OGTs and Ohio Achievement Assessments. Uh, of course, we won't get official numbers until later this summer, but I want to share with you some of the preliminary results. When we take a look at our cohort group 2013, in other words, the graduating class of 2013, this year's sophomores who just took the Ohio graduation test, and we take a look at their performance uh, proficiency rate compared to when they were eighth grade students. And we see that our proficiency rate has increased by 27.1% in reading, 20.8% in math, 16.6% uh, in science, and 24.2% in social studies. Outstanding job by our, by our staff and our principals at, it, at the secondary school, and most importantly, outstanding job by our students, Cohort Group 2013. Another measure of our performance uh, with regard to OGT scores is taking a look at the performance index, which accounts for all students across the board, whether they're limited or basic or proficient or accelerated or advanced. And uh, uh, we take a look at that performance index over the last three years. 2009, the performance index was 90.7. 2010, it was 92.1. In 2011, our performance index is 95.6 for the OGT results. A couple of measures uh, that suggest we have had significant progress over the last, uh, the last three years, and uh, it's all due to our, our great principals and great teachers uh, at those grade levels. So great job to those folks, proud of them. We can't wait to see the rest of the results as the, as the summer unfolds. At the elementary, we've, we've seen this similar progress uh, with regard to our third grade math students. Math has been a tough, uh, tough subject area for us in, in Bucyrus Elementary School, in Bucyrus City Schools. Our third grade students, the percentage of students who are at risk in mathematics, uh, went from, at the beginning of the year, from 26.9% of our students at risk in mathematics in third grade to, at the end of the year, only 13.4% of our students are at risk in mathematics. Now, admittedly, we still have a ways to go with regard to that statistic, but we cut the number in half, and I'm really proud of those students, and really proud of our staff at, at third grade level. Across the entire elementary school, with regard to reading, and we know that that's one of our core areas that we have to focus on. Uh, in terms of the number of students who were below grade level across the entire elementary school, we had 298 students who were below grade level in reading at the beginning of the year in September. And May, our results are 237 students who are below grade level in reading, a reduction of 61 students who are now at grade level um, or above. Uh, and in terms of above grade level, those students that are, that are beyond their 
uh, chronological grade level uh, with regard to their reading skills. At the beginning of the year, we had 282 students who met that criteria. And at the end of the year, we had 309 students who met that criteria. So we've added 27 students who are above grade level in reading and reduced the number of students who are below grade level by 61 students over the course of the year. Again, indicators of the tremendous progress that's taking place in the Bucyrus City Schools. And, uh, and again, kudos go out to great, great principals and great teachers at those grade levels. And kudos go out to the students for all the hard work uh, they've demonstrated over the course of the year. It's really important as we go into the summer months to sustain that level of growth and to come back to us in the fall at least where you left us in the spring. So with that, have a fantastic June. Uh, be proud of our kids, be proud of our teachers, be proud of our principals, they've done a great job. Have a good day.